All right, you guys, so this is a mess right now. Um, I didn't do my bed today, uh, but because I knew I was gonna be painting and moving the, the bed and all that stuff. Um, but anyways, this, we just got a new bed. This is a king bed, um, and we had a queen before. So this is the headboard that we had on the other bed. Um, but my mom, we're actually gonna be gifting that to my mom, so um, that's why we've kept it in here. But, but, you guys know me, I'm a DIYer, and if I see something, I always try to <laughs> try to replicate it if I could. Um, so I've been Pinteresting some, um, picture, some DIY half circle headboards. Uh, I'll try to put in some pictures so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Um, so my plan is to make one here now. The only thing that I have to worry about is I have to make sure that I'm not gonna wanna move the bed anymore. So I'm really caught in between doing it against this wall or this wall. I'm not sure. Um, so that's like the only struggle I have going on. A little bit of part of me wants to do it on this wall, but then I kind of want it to be like a focal point when you walk into the room and when you walk into the bedroom, this is the first wall that you see. And um, these are just, this is like a, this was like the old headboard that I did. It was like a, like a lighted, very light headboard. But I'm just so over it. And you guys could see this room just needs a little sprucing up. So I don't know if I should do that wall or this wall. But regardless, what I'm trying to do is like a half, circle headboard um, I already picked out the paint and the color I just don't know if I want it high or low I don't know I don't know I don't know I have to pick like see it in my head but that's what we are doing today so let's do this okay guys so I think I'm gonna do this wall uh, I just talked to my husband and he made a good point. He said, when you walk in, it'll be the main focal point. Whereas if I put it on this wall, it just kind of throws everything off. I'm just kind of bummed because I have more work for myself. I have to move the rug. I have to move the bed. <laughs> I have to move that. But he did make a good point. So as much as I want to do it here, just because of the lighting, I feel like there's more lighting on this wall. I think it would look better on that wall. So, <sighs> I, he chose the harder decision for me, but it's okay. It'll look better. So, I'm just gonna move everything around and we'll be right back. Okay, so between me and the, the boys, because my husband's working, uh, we moved the bed. And then I, you guys saw I took that stuff down. Um, and then, hi Izzy. And then, so what I'm going to do, I, I already kind of marked. So I kind of um, just got like a measuring tape and then followed it to the wall here. And that's why I did the mark. Oops, sorry. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, it's hard to do this filming because um, I don't have someone to help me film. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to find the middle <clears throat> I'm gonna find the middle from this corner to that corner of the bed, and I'm gonna hammer this um, nail in the middle of, if that makes sense. So hold on, let me just put it like in better perspective for you. Okay, so I made a, a dot on the wall there, on this corner, and then I made a dot there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna nail this nail right in the middle in between those two dots and then from there I'll you know what let me just do a step at a time because then I'm gonna confuse myself so I'm gonna do that right now okay so let's hope let's hope that this is the middle oh shoot where'd it go okay here don't want to make it all the way through you're just putting it in enough okay so you don't want to put it all the way through you're just putting it in enough to where 
Um, it can grip, like it has a grip on it. Okay, so now you're going to make a knot around around the nail. Make sure that the knot is really tight. This is gonna be like your grip for the pencil when you do the, the half circle. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay, so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna kind of see how big you want your circle, your half circle to be. <laughs> Man, I don't know how big I want it. Um, should we get it that big or bigger? I'm gonna start small because then I could just go bigger, right? Okay, so you're gonna tie your string, your um, your pencil. Okay, so let's just do it. I'm just gonna leave a little bit extra. No, you're so we're just gonna. Okay, I'm just gonna tie it like this. And then I left a little bit of extra um, yarn just in case I want my circle bigger. But I might not want it bigger. Okay, so what I did is I left it as close as I could to the, to the tip of the pencil. So now, let's hope that this works. <laughs> Okay, so the lighting in here sucks, but that's my outline. So I had did did it. I know if you guys you guys could probably see that it's wet. Well, I went in there with a magic razor to erase the previous line I did because it just seemed too big, um, and I'm kind of a little doubting myself still. But I'm just gonna go for it because I could just paint right over it, right? If I don't like it, that's what I'm hanging on to at least. <laughs> Okay, um, I think I'm just going to start painting already because, I mean, let's do it.
All right, you guys, so that's what I have right now. And in person, it doesn't look even. <laughs> but right now that I'm seeing it on um, on the lens, on the camera, it does look pretty, pretty even. I think it's just my eyes already been doing this for a while. It's already dark outside. So um, I already went along the edge. So now I just need to paint it. And I think once I paint it, that's going to kind of give me the, an idea of how, like if I need to go a little bit wider, if I need a little go a little bit rounder. But I'm pretty content with it, to be honest. Um, I mean, essentially, you know, the bed's going to be against it and then the pillows and all that stuff. So I'm not going to be too picky about it. Um, and I feel like when you paint more organically it looks better I don't know if that makes any sense but like if you do get close you can see kind of like where my pencil outlines are so that's where I'll, I'm gonna go in with the magic eraser and paint that but so now I'm just gonna fill it all in I'm so nervous I don't know I, I don't know <laughs> you guys every regret that I thought I had I take it back I love this wall <laughs> I love it I so 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 freaking love it I am done with the first coat but I think I am gonna go in with the second coat because you can kind of see some white spots still but I love it oh my gosh I, I just imagine when it's just decorated and it looks so nice. A hundred. Hundred. <laughs>